A stratagem. Cuteness colonialism is a formidable success. This special relationship with species omega-3-1 is the economic backbone of our mission. The nutrient-rich organic material shared with us is hermetically sealed by a thin sheet of metal. Species omega-3-1 refers to these metal receptacles as can or tin. Tin just rang a bell. I'm afraid I must digress. May I present to you the tintinid? Fascinating creatures. These unicellular protist life forms resemble superficially the organism vorticella, but in a Thin. Vorticella is a stunningly beautiful unicellular organism. Cross-reference attached. Just like Vorticella, most tintinids consist of a ciliated head portion and a stoke portion allowing to retract. The creatures mostly feed on debris and microscopic algae. Tintinids are ciliates mostly found in seawater, with some exceptions leaving in freshwater. They are extraordinarily good swimmers, reaching astounding speeds. How? Fascinating. The name tintinid refers to the shape of these organisms' prominent shells. The can opener word tintinid imitates the sound of ringing bells. Tin, tin. Obviously, this creative name tries to describe the peculiar housings in onomatopoeic fashion. The freshwater species almost exclusively build their shells or tests from microscopic sand grains, a very noteworthy behavior found also in other unicellular life forms like amoebas. Single cells without a brain or nervous system building intricately sophisticated structures. Absolutely fascinating. Hunger is blurring up my mind. My apologies, the golden shining sparkly goodness will be served shortly by my can opener servants. Yum, yum. The intricate manipulation appendices on the extremities of species omega-3-1, known as hands, are the only feature that makes the species relevant to our mission. So why haven't I named them tin openers? Hmm. That just rang a bell again. Tintinates are extremely sensitive to changes in temperature, salinity, and oxygen levels. They are specialized in habitats with stable conditions like lagoons or bays. Especially the marine species get obliterated within minutes after they were taken out of their environments. The cells decay and vanish completely. The only thing that remains of a tintinid is its shell. A distant echo 
of life. My strong sense of duty obliges me to provide an approximate description of the Ken Opener's physiognomy. Species Omega 3 1 is defined by four extremities a head portion, second head.